family, welcome to Sherry's Crafting 2017. Here we're one great big family. I know my hair, um, it's all over the place. Uh, grandbabies are asleep. So now it's my relaxing time with you guys. And, um, I got my coffee, I done made a pot, done got the girls to sleep, and enjoying every single moment of it. But today, I guess they were trying me or something, because they were fighting today. <laughs> I was like, oh my God. They remind me of their father when he was that age. But they finally realized that Mama was not letting us get away with this. And time out. One of them kept telling me, no, no. I said, oh yeah, it's time out time. You sit there. No. Yeah, you are. And you start pouting. I said, pouting don't work with my mom. And she sat there. She was just trying me to see what she could get away with. But they have had a ball. And it has been a storm in here, guys. I mean, my babies can't even get outside and play. I'm like, they wanted to go outside today and they look out the window. It's raining, Mama. I said, so we can't go outside. There's a big mud hole. I'm like, yeah, but you ain't getting in it. <laughs> it's raining. I mean, thunder and lightning, you name it, it was doing it. But y'all, I got to drink some coffee before we get started with this. This is going to be decor for your bathroom. You know, fall time you have to do something for your bathrooms too guys so don't forget about those you know and your bedrooms you know you gotta have a little fall off through the house don't just take and leave it out for just your dining room and your living room so we're working in the bathroom my second cup of coffee today I didn't get finished with my first one this morning they wanted, uh, they wanted Fruit Loops. They didn't want, uh, eggs and bacon or sausage. They said, no, nah, tomorrow. Um, I want to, uh, also, guys, do a, a, a shout out for, uh, Trailer Park Mom. If y'all, um, have not subscribed to her, go check her out. Um, she has a learning disability and um, she has two small children. She's a great mom and go check her out guys and kind of, you know, um, keep her spirits up. She's been having a lot of problems with some, some bad people on her channel and kind of got her upset and um, I just want to let her know that, you know, girl, I'm praying for you. Anytime you need me, I'm here. You know, I made some comments in her, um, one of her videos to let her know. You know, hold your head up high. Don't, don't let them know that, um, it's bothering you. But when they mess with your children and threaten you like that, Mother Bear does come out. So, sweetheart, you're doing the right thing. Now, you just put that on the back burner and move on. You're doing great. Don't let them uh, stop you from doing your videos. You're a sweet lady. All right, guys. Let's get started. I had to say that because I hate when people bully people. I mean, really. I hate it. And especially with someone that has a learning disability and because my son Micah has a learning disability and if someone picks on him mama bear does come out 
and I know exactly how she feels. Okay, guys, let's get started. Um, I got two of these kind of yellowish vases, kind of an orange tint to it, um, from Dollar Tree. You need that. You need your trusty glue gun and glue sticks, some floral tape, and I'm using an old reef that I had. Um, I don't really remember where I got it from, but I'm taking some of this stuff off of here because um, I don't like the reef because it's falling apart. And I went upstairs and got it out of the attic, so we're going to use, and you need some stores, 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 whatever you want to call them, you need some, I'm going to get some of these out, and you need The girls were in here today. Um, we was gonna do our hand prints and uh, palm in the uh, plaster of Paris, but um, I gotta get some more plaster of Paris. So you need orange um, burlap ribbon. You need the orange metallic ribbon. You need. Um, the Happy Harvest um, ribbon. It's got all kind of saying on it, fall and everything. It's the nine feet one. And the other one is a nine feet. All this comes from Dollar Tree. Except that reef. I don't remember where I got it. You need some clear gems, the small ones. And you need some big gems. You need some floral wire. I got to it up right here. Floral wire from Dollar Tree. And you need some flowers of your toys. And I'm just grabbed all the ones that I had still left over here. And we're just to get started. All right, what I want to do first, I want to take this O brief and I'm pulling out my pumpkins. And you see how they're kind of like on a stick? And pull this one out. Let's see. I mean, you can use anything, guys, that you have, and that's what I'm doing. And I'm going to pull my fall leaves out of this one. And y'all see how um, this thing is just falling apart. I just kind of want to get everything off of here. Because I'm going to also use that as some little accent filler pieces. And I got my garbage can behind me. And all I'm doing is pulling these out. And this reef here is going in garbage. I mean, it's just, I think I've had it for a couple of years. And we had it on our front door the other house and I wanted to throw it away and then I got thinking you know maybe I could use the stuff that was on here so I'm reusing that'll save me some moolah and no I have not been shopping I am not getting my grandbabies out in rain and we've had flooding, we got flood, we're under flood line, a lot of the streets here are flooding, 
so I'm like, uh-uh, uh-uh. Not get them out. It's got to be prettier. Because, I mean, my babies, they want to go swimming. One that had the earache, she woke up this morning. It don't hurt, mama. Is it good? Tell us this girl. We kept on with that earache. We was going to take her to the doctor. And let her get checked out for an ear infection. But, undoubtedly, it wasn't an ear infection because she says it ain't hurting. And she's been playing and been fine today, so. Holy y'all. I'm going to have a mess. I got a vacuum in here. Came back in the night, not with babies. Let's get that broom. Let's get this. <clears throat> I've been trying to fold the girls to uh, hang them up. I'm not just going to hang them up in the closet, kind of. So they'd have a place for their clothes. Alright, guys, what I'm going to do is. I'm going to take one of my stores, schoolers, whatever you want to call them. I'm going to pull this here out because it's short and I don't want that. And I'm going to make sure this will fit in here. It will. I'm going to put some hot glue. Move this where I get it from. And I'm putting it on the pointy side. So the pointed part will be up in gourd looking thing. And I'm going to take a few of these little fall leaves that I got off of here. And all I'm going to do is I'm going to kind of place them around a little bit. And put one of these berries. And put it pretty leaf. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take a piece of this wire. And I'm gonna wrap around to my stick. Make sure you kind of pull tight. Even though I'm going to put a little bit of the floral tape around it to kind of help secure it too, so you won't be able to see the wire. Because I want this to have a little bit of height to it. That's the reason I'm going to use the Sticks. Y'all know what they called. Stewers, schoolers, stewers. Whatever. Let me put y'all over here where y'all can see what I'm doing. Sorry, guys. Y'all know. I turd. 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 Let's start at the top. Pull it tight as I twist it. And I'm going to take and cover my whole stick all the way down because I don't want y'all seeing the stick part. And you just keep going and going. And going, twisting and 
putting it on here as you go. And I warn you, new subscribers, we're above 700 now. Um, my videos do get long sometimes. I'm sorry, but I go step by step. I prefer to go right on through and show you all of it and get it going. And instead of going back and trying to put it together, I'm just going to stick it in my face for now because we're just going to do another one. I'm going to grab another pumpkin. Go ahead and take this stick off of this one too. And if they act like that little hard, kind of twist and pull. Alright, here we go again. Put some hot glue on the end of my stick. And poke it in. My pumpkin. And y'all know y'all can get these pumpkins at Dollar Tree. Instead of using old ones. And if you got some old ones from last year, grab them suckers. Reuse, y'all. That's what I'm doing. Save some moolah. But, guys, if y'all hadn't subscribed, please do so. Had to get that in there. I'm going to put a leaf here. It's kind of got a little wire on it. Um, so I'm kind of wrapping it a little bit. And I'm going to put it here. And I'm just kind of eyeballing it, guys. I'm not trying to get it all in one pattern. I'm just mixing it up. Since this is a small one, I'll hold that there. And there's some kind of like little berry looking things. Let me get that in there. And you can make it as full as you want. That's got, that's got a freaking nail. Look. Seriously? Thank God I seen that and didn't get stuck. When did they start putting needles in that? Let me get my wire cutters and cut some wire off. Cause this wire here is all tangled up, but I'm trying to use it. Use what I got. Can you see? You got my glasses on. And start wrapping around it. Just like we did on the other one. But guys, I can't believe we're above 700. I think it was like 702. Last time I checked, I was like, yay, we're moving on up. <laughs> no, I'm not going to sing. I used to. I don't do that anymore. <clears throat> And the grandbabies were singing. We were singing today. The wheels on the bus go round and round. Alright, there's another one. <laughs> Alright. Um, they were out doing me. And the youngest one should go round and round. Should be two in October. And I kept saying two. Um, 
and Ray Ray. She's three. Her name is Rachel, but I call her Ray Ray. She's sweet as she can be. All, all of them are sweet. I mean, literally. They were just trying their mama today. Do, 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 do. Now there's some more berries. There's some weird berries. Just the owl maple. A relief you find from Dollar Tree. It'll say maple. Nice but this might have came from Dollar Tree. Oh. A few years ago. I'm trying to remember, guys. But I'm sorry, I hadn't done no hauls. It's just enjoying my babies. Don't worry, I'll make up for it. Yeah, there's one. She says, we're going shopping. It's not as ring. Oh, that's what she said. Oh, sure. Papa say, oh, and he's really been enjoying it. This morning he was playing with them while they was eating their cereal. He took and got the spoon and started to act like a choo-choo train. And... Rachel, she started laughing. McKinley, she was laughing. And so I videoed it and sent it to their daddy and mama so they could see. And he's like, Mom, you know they can they can feed themselves. I said, No, but he was playing with them. You know? I mean, they were laughing down. I'm like, these girls. I was picking with Rachel. And I told her, I said, there's school bus. Where? Outside. It's here to get you. Uh-uh. I small. I'm like, you don't want to go to school? I small. I'm like, you gotta get ready to go to school. No, I small. Yeah, I know. That girl, she, she really looks serious. Now, I'm going to take and put some of these leaves on the store without the pumpkin. And I am not grabbing that needle. I don't know why they got a needle in that. Looks like a sewing needle. See, I'll watch out what y'all buy. My one of them needle on it. I'm just wrapping the wire around. Same way. I know that's not how I'm displaying that. That's just something to hold these till I get it done. And I've got this stuff all over me. But I hope and pray y'all have had a great day. Hope y'all not getting all this rain. And guys, you can make this here like this with the uh, take your flowers off the stems. If you want to make them longer. 
And um, I had somebody wanting to know how you make um, foam roses. Um, when I get a chance um, to go to um, the store, I'll get some foam and show you how to make them. Now, it might not be the color you want, but, I mean, you know, any color that you want, you know, you can make it your own. Okay. Ow! That was got fire in it, and it hurts. Make sure it wasn't a needle. That's going to make me look from now on to see. But look, guys. It's a needle stuck in. Can y'all see that? And it's got a little blue head. We're stuck in the leaf. Hit it out and pick it over in the garbage can so I can get rid of it. I don't want somebody getting stuck. I don't know why they put that in there. I'm cutting a piece of wire. And do one more. Then we're going to start working on. Our ribbon for our flowers. Cause I want a ribbon. I want a colorful. You know, I'm always putting colorful flowers. Why not put colorful ribbon? Kind of bring it all together. I know this is a lot of. Maple leaves, but I'm making two vases, so you know the colors are gonna. It's not all gonna be orange. We got some other stuff down here, and I'll show you what I'm using. And I'm repeating myself. It's all from Dollar Tree, except. I don't know where I got the leaf. I mean, being honest, I don't. I don't remember. Ow! All I know is I picked it up somewhere. It might have been Dollar General. I don't know. Then again, it might have been Dollar Tree. Do, do, do. But guys, to me, this is relaxing. And girls, this morning did not wake up till 9.30. I couldn't believe it. I was like, I guess they were wore out from yesterday playing. Alright. Now that's all the stewards that we need. Well, we need two. Because I'm putting my ribbons on my sticks instead of on the base. Alright, let me clean this off real quick. I can't stand working in a dirty area. Use this calendar and empty all this in the garbage. Sorry, guys. I just don't like trash.
and the girls today they were trying to help me pick up in the living room getting toys and stuff put up and they they were doing great I mean, and they love to cook oh I'm like we're gonna cook they help me cook all right guys what I'm doing is I'm opening up my wedding because I'm gonna get this done first You guys can see how I do mine. I know I done one with, one with the trying to do it. Let me turn it down just a little bit. I drink coffee. I want. I really want to enjoy this coffee. And yes, I have shorts on, so I know I know I'm probably gonna hear something. I have shorts. All right, let me get my scissors. I still got my glue gun on. I am going to estimate about right there. And I'm going to cut two. For this one. And I'm going to cut two for my other one. So that's one. And they don't have to be even, guys. You can estimate, you know, make it the way you want. This is just the way I do it. I'm not a ribbon maker. I just do it this way. And cut four of these. just the way I like doing one. I mean you can add more um, ribbons if you don't like the way it turns out here. You can add more, make it more fluffier. I got my candle over here burning. I almost put my ribbon on it. for each one. So we can have it to where it looks the same. 
I mean, if you don't want to put it in the bathroom, you can put it um, in your bedroom, um, kitchen, wherever. Doesn't matter. Don't necessarily have to be a bathroom. Alright, since I'm not going to use that other orange, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to take one and I'm going to grab about that much, squinch it together, and twist, well, no, come in the back side and twist it and make another loop. What am I doing? Sherry, you messing up. I forgot, guys. <laughs> Take it over like this. No. Twist it. Alright, where's my orange? Lord, if y'all want to know how to make a ribbon, watch my other video. Get this wire here. And I really don't like this orange because this glittery stuff is coming off. If y'all want to know how to make the bows, go to my other video. Because this one is really not turning out the way I want it to. But I'm going to fluff it out. And show you all. I really want to keep this one on a stick instead of putting it on the jar. Alright, grab my stick. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to clip off the sharp part. this in here and wrap the wire around my stick and 
Anything quilt. Oh, my nose is itching. Grab your floral tape. Hold, okay. Get you back in that hole. I'm aware. Grab it. Don't worry, guys. I'm gonna come back up there and fix that. Where it's wanting to come off. I don't think I had no wire tie enough. A wire around it. And all it's going loose. Surprise me. Because basically, all I'm really wanting is just the little loops. So, guess what? Don't give up, guys. If it wants to do like it wants to do, you just take and don't let it defeat you. Make it work. Because basically all I was really wanting is the loops. So, oops. At the top. So if it wants to just come loose, that's fine. And I'll show you how to fix it. Alright, do the floor one. Grab your loops, pull them out. And I'm going to leave tails on for right now. And grab the other one. <clears throat> and clean this up. Try to get this piece of wire clear. Okay. This stuff is a wanting, not wanting to cooperate. So, here's what I'm going to do I'm going to take it and I'm going to fold it like this and squish it together and grab this side. And squish it together. Grab this one. Squish it 
brush it together, turn, and squish it together. Because basically all, all I'm really wanting is the bows. I really don't care about the tools. Now, if you want tails, you know, you can do, watch my other video and I'll show you how to do them. But, I'm just wanting the loops. I'm not wanting the tails. But if you want tails, you can always go back and watch my other video and it'll show you how to do it. How to make bows. You know how sometimes the bows just don't want to cooperate? Well, this is one of them times, and I'm just going to make this work this way. I've got this orange stuff all over me. I don't think I'll be using that ribbon anymore because I don't like that. It sheds. <clears throat> Still bad about picking stuff up, so I'm make sure there's nothing in the floor. And don't worry, I'm gonna come back and flip this out. Y'all know me. I'm just gonna go ahead and get this wrapped around this stick. the paint over here the girls um so they can paint tomorrow and I'm painting the garage on two poster boards so they can paint all right now that I have this on here. What I want to do is, is fluff these round parts out like so. Don't have to be all the same way. You can fluff it out however you want. I just want it for the fluffy part. Alright, got that done. Now, I'm going to clean this here up and we'll start putting the flowers in and show you guys what it looks like. Alright, I'm going to take all these out. 
Oops. So A here. Grab a drink of coffee. Lord. Grandma jars. Y'all gonna hear some noise. I'm putting some of the big ones and And the reason I'm using a clear is because I don't want the blue coming through. See y'all, I got the big ones in. Now, I'll put some of the small ones. And don't worry, uh, all of these are put up where the babies can't get these because they are small. All right, I'm gonna put in my bows. Get them in. The other bow. Put it in the other jar. these tags. Um, this is the grass with the feathers. As y'all can see, I spread them out a little bit. But now on the back side, spread it out. And this one is the grass with the feathers. I'm kind of changing the colors up a little bit because I want a little bit of difference, but not too much. You know, you kind of want a little matching. They don't have to be matchy matchy. I want to use the same colors. I'm going to put this one in behind this one. All right, now I got some wheat. And I'm going to put it in here. And spray it out a little bit. And I'm going in behind my bows a little bit. Grab the other weight. You see what I mean about the colors? Ow, I knew I was going to do that. Put that wheat back on.
All right, put that one in there. Now I am using the sunflowers that have the burlap and they also have the cattails. And I'm putting these in the front. And I'm pushing them all the way in, spreading them out. Grab this one the same way on the other one. Right in the front of the bow. Moms, but I only have one stem, so more a little bit more, but a little shorter in the front. And I'm gonna do that. I do my cutters, but I'm not cutting off the the greenery. I don't want. I just want. The most. Guys, you can add whatever you want. That off. Just make it your home. Don't necessarily have to do it the same way I'm doing. Unless you really like it. Alright, I am coming in. Put one there. And put one down here. And do the same thing over here. And no, not three. Almost forgot about these babies. You yeah, forget about them. All right, let's see. Um. I'm going to put pumpkin right in behind there. Don't worry. I'm going to show you. I don't like white. I'm going to put this one on this. And this one. And here, and then I'm going to put the follies of the berry in here. And I'm just going to stick this one. I'll add a little more to this one. What do you think? Here's one. This is the back side. And this is the front. And you can kind of play around with your flowers, put them whichever way you want. But that's one. And here is the other one. 
What do you think? Let me know, guys. All right, guys. I love y'all. God bless. Talk to y'all later. Bye. Oh, an hour? I'm sorry.